Go on, boom, boom. This is our most desperate hour. Unless we make a stand here and now, we gonna die. Now. Roll for initiative! What's initiative? It says which order we attack in. I punched the initiative. What's going on? I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> Tina, why don't you start over? Ahem. <clears throat> Welcome, fine ladies, to your first session of the most coolest game in the world, Bunkers and Badasses! As your Bunker Master, I will be spinning today's tale of fantasy and... Wait, why the hell are we playing this kid's game? Oh, you know, maybe because... Shut the hell up, Morty! Tina? She's right, though. Shut up. While our vault hunting buddies beat the slam a jam out of that Hyperion informant downstairs, I thought we could play a game. Now, pick your characters. You got the Necromancer, the Commando, the Siren... Siren. Dibs. My Siren's name is Brick. And she is the prettiest. <laughs> Why don't we just start now and figure that out later? Come on, girl. You know we gotta wait for Roland before we start. Tina, Roland's... You know Roland's not coming, right? He's not here anymore. Yeah, he's probably running late or something. We'll just start now. So, like I said... Roll for initiative, suck up! You arrive at the docks of Flame Rock Refuge. This place used to be really nice, until the handsome sorcerer messed everything up. I say we head toward the town to investigate. It's a lovely day in Flame Rock Refuge. A far cry from... Wait, didn't you just say the sorcerer messed up the town? Why would things be lovely? Uh, whoops. Uh, what I meant to say is, it's eternal night, and you hear spooky music, and the whole area kind of smells like butts and dead people. Hey, this area smells vaguely of butts and death. An unpleasant stench. Can I laugh? <laughs> yeah.